What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition HPI. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button and be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs. Cut through side to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys. Okay, so I received a channel message. Um, I'm not going to make this too long. I might pull a card or two. We'll see. But um, only take the message or messages that resonate uh, and leave the rest. Free general collective reading is very important. Uh, personal readings are currently open right now, but they're only going to be open until Friday. Just let everybody know. So until the 9th, uh, just let you know. Okay? And thanks for all the recent donations. And if you'd like to donate, link's in the description box below. Okay, so the channel message I received was somebody, um, someone that um, put a vehicle in your name in the past. I heard uh, fraud, fraud. Um, they're about to get into a motor vehicle accident. I heard total vehicle, total vehicle in that vehicle. Um, I heard uh, many negative series of chain events are about to occur for these people. I heard, and you will be contacted. Um I heard lots of truth is about to come out regarding this. You plug it in how it resonates. They never told you. They never told you. I just heard just now. They never told you. So whoever this is, they put a vehicle in your name, in your name, but never told you. And they did it in fraudulent ways, obviously, because they never told you. I'm assuming they might have signed your name to the title or signed your name on the paperwork or signed your name for the loan or something. Um, I don't know if it's paid off or not paid off, but they never told you that they basically frauded your signature or your information or your personal information or whatever they did to put your name on this vehicle. Definite fraudulent signature I'm feeling, if not use of personal information. I didn't hear, I mean like other information, but I don't know. But it sounds like your name is definitely on the title of this vehicle, is what it sounds like, or the loan or something. Um, how that resonates. Like I said, I don't know if it's paid off or not paid off. But th whoever did this, if this resonates for you, they have, they're about to get into a, a motor vehicle accident in this vehicle. And I heard it's about to total it. It's about to total it. And it's going to create negative series of chain of events for them. I heard you will be contacted, and then negative series of chain of events will occur for them. Well, it should. So, ne Distant Horizons is upcoming in the universe. It hasn't happened yet. Number 36 will be a very significant number in one's life. Number 36. Um, number 36. Charges will be pressed once you find out this information. Charges will be pressed once you find out this information. So, I don't know who's going to contact you. I didn't hear specifically. I don't know if it's a, um, the police, investigators, um, the insurance company, if they have insurance, or um, or what have you, what have you. I mean, you're supposed to have at least liability uh, in most states, but I don't know what state this is in, what area it is in, what country this is in, but um, you're about to get contact from somebody. I heard you will press charges. So whoever you are, you don't mess around, and I don't blame you. I wouldn't either. Um, so it's upcoming. It hasn't happened yet. It's about to happen soon. It's about to happen soon. So upcoming, futuristic, soon energy in the universe. Oh, God. Significant. I mean, but it sounds like it's negative karma for them. All right, let's keep going. Spirit message. Okay, whoa. It blew out. Gift reverse, number 17. Could be very significant number in one's life. Number 17. Let's keep going. Experiment to this year collective. They're about to experience huge criminal issues with this. Huge. They're about to experience huge criminal issues with this. Huge. So this could be the criminal issues, legal issues, criminal legal criminal legal issues coming up. Because there's many type of legal issues. You know, there's family court, there's property law, um, uh, 
criminal side, um, they're about to experience huge criminal issues with this. So courthouse energy, legal issues, criminal issues. Um, I'm feeling a meeting with the judge or judges, um, maybe jail. I, I hope jail. I mean, damn, I heard you're going to press charges. So probably jail, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Gift reverse is not going to be a gift for them. They're about to get into this motor vehicle accident with the vehicle that they basically Sounds like forged your signature on it. Heard fraud, but that's forgery if they frauded your signature. That's forgery. And I heard the motor vehicle accident is going to happen soon. So like the chariot energy. Let's see. I'll show you guys. It's like the chariot energy. Except chariot reversed. They're about to ever regret they did this. They're going to be so publicly humiliated. They're about to ever regret they did this. They're about to be so publicly humiliated. So, yeah, it's like chariot reverse. Because chariot upright is like forward movement or a vehicle. Um, it could indicate a vehicle. But it'd be like chariot reverse in the energetic space. Crash of the motor vehicle. Uh, motor vehicle. And I heard it's going to total it. So it's not going to be a little fender bender, a little bump. It's not going to be a scratch. It's going to be a total it. So like the the vehicle totaled. Chariot reversed. Hmm. Heard that they're, uh, they're going to ever regret they did this. And I'm sure, well, they shouldn't have never done it. And that's just the truth. Once this occurs, it's going to create a negative snowball effect for this person. Alcohol may be involved in this crash. Once this occurs, it's going to create a negative snowball effect for this person. Alcohol may be involved in this crash. May blow over on the breathalyzer if a breathalyzer is used. Okay, I heard alcohol may be involved in this crash and they may blow over on the breathalyzer if um, if a breathalyzer is used. So you plug it in. They're, def they, they're an alcohol user and I don't feel a social drinker. Um, because if they were a social drinker, they would have quit when they decided to operate a motor vehicle. And that's just the truth. So I heard if a breathalyzer is used. So you know, may, may not be used, um, but to me, if I was an officer of the law, which I'm not, I don't want to be, but if I smelt alcohol on a person or smelt it on their breath, if I pulled them over, or I'm, well, it wouldn't be pulling them over, it'd be a crash, uh, if I, if they were walking funny or talking, slurring their speech, or you could smell the alcohol on them, why the hell would not somebody not administer a breathalyzer? I'm just saying. I mean, of course, they need medical care if they need medical care. But I'm just saying. But I heard their uh, negative series of chain events are about to occur with them uh, after this. And you will definitely be contacted. All right, I'm closing this out. I love you guys. I'm going to stay.